What is this? This music reminds me of uh, uh, World of Illusion, starring Mickey Mouse and Donald Duck, for some reason. I don't know why. Welcome back, everybody. I'm Nate. And I'm Eric. And this is 99 Vidas. This is the first bonus stage, which looks like a child's drawing. This is a foreign version of the bibliography for Gore Vidal. Yeah, there you go. Yep, yeah. We'll go with that. We'll go with that. <laughs> Go! Uh, this bonus stage is actually like a really good place to. Uh, I don't know why we don't why we don't go to the store before this one, but at the same time, it is a nice place to get a point if you're trying to. I don't know, grind so that you can unlock everything because last time you played, your fifth best friend in the world was like, "This game, I don't want to play this game anymore." Like, <laughs> we gotta finish this game, you know. We got We gotta see the ending. <laughs> Wait. You turn cutscenes off. Are we going to see the ending? We can turn it back on for the final oh, one. Oh, okay. I didn't know if it was like an option we had to do from the main menu or something. Well, there's a big old marker well, there's here. There's a screen select. There's, there's a big old there's, marker right there. This game does say where you are. Oh, uh, okay. I didn't know. I didn't know. But it does not save your score if you use a uh, new game or a screen selection. That makes sense. It's a beat em up. It's all about score, baby. All about that score. You gotta score like these goalies. I don't know soccer. <laughs> I watched like the big green once in like elementary school. That's my that's the extent of my soccer knowledge. That and David Beckham's butt. Oh lord. <laughs> I can't Ah That speaker came at the exact right time for my joke. Yeah, really. <laughs> hey nice! Hey, he sounds nice. Australian. Yeah, we we noticed that last time. It's so bizarre. It's really like Compared to everyone else, he sounds so Australian. Yeah. It's really weird. Also, let's do a special move. Oh, Lord. <laughs> Whee! They have, like, no sound. It's so weird. And you also don't get any points for them, basically. That would make sense. But at the same time, it also kind of doesn't? I know, because you're still killing them. Right. I mean, let's be honest here. Oh, there's a pan. Woo! Pan pizza. Oh my gosh, we should make pizza tonight. Pizza! I got DiGiorno. It's not delivery! It's my penis. <laughs> oh my gosh. So, I... So, speaking of bad conduct, uh... <laughs> oh! That's right, we need to take a break so I can go get the mail, because guess what I got today? Uh... It starts with fighting and it ends with foodons. Oh. <laughs> the complete series. <laughs> That's right. Another Pokemon clone. Yeah, one I, I very vaguely remember from my childhood. <laughs> Fighting food on... It's something food with attitude. Yeah, I remember it being very weird <laughs> in Japanese. It was like it was like you would prepare food and then like bring it to life. And But that brings up so many questions like what if the... Food spoils. Does it die? Yeah. Yeah, then it becomes a zombie. Obviously, Nate. Do you have to make. I think there was something like you had to make the same dish over and over again. I might be wrong on that. I don't. It's like how do you do you just like carry around a refrigerator with you and like stuff people into it? These are the questions I want to know, which is why I bought the complete season. I think you're series. looking too far into fighting foodons. Can you put food soul into food? And if so, is Peta correct about everything? <laughs> Those, these are questions I need answers to, which is why I will be watching Fighting Foodons. Fighting Foodons! Fighting Foodons! How do they reproduce? Oh, again, I think you're looking too far into Fighting Foodons. I don't think I'm looking far enough into Fighting I think, Foodons. I think you're looking plenty far. I don't think so. <laughs> Then we're just we're just gonna have to agree to disagree on that one. I don't have to do anything you say. <laughs> That's what consent is about. Oh lord. <laughs> Woo! All right. And now the final boss for the bonus stage, which is the final boss of this. First it's literally the, the same stage. boss. Pretty much. I don't know why my why my controller is like lagging a little bit. Is it? Yeah. Uh oh. I don't know. Maybe ah. it's from my, maybe it's from my, uh, you know, extreme charisma. <laughs> I was told by a coworker I probably have the m most likable phone voice in the company. <laughs> 
Which is strange because I hate the phone. I hate phones. I hate phones. I don't use them. I just use them for the Tinder like Garrett does. Oh, Lord. All right. So that was a bonus stage. And this is a girl with really Look at her arms. nubbing arms. Look at her nubby arms. They're so nubby. Next time on Fighting Food on the series. I buy a shitload of lives. Same here. We'll see you guys next time. Bye.